Hello, this is Patriot of the Republic 1, Mike Fulmer, saying good morning and hi to everyone. Well, I'm going to be reading about a bill that was recently passed this past week. And well, this, this line or this article will be... <laughs> Regarding the trespass bill HR 347 that makes protest illegal in the land of the free. The House just passed the trespass bill HR 347. The new bill HR 347 makes it a federal offense to protest government business or functions or against people or places under Secret Service protection. Anti-government protests punishable by up to 10 years in prison. My opinion. I feel this bill will put the First Amendment, the freedom of speech, to its death and put it in a coffin in the ground. The First Amendment, rest in peace, 1791-2012. And down below this video, in the definition box, I will have some info about the trespass bill HR 347, or you can do a Google, a complete Google search about this bill HR 347 well I would like to talk about this bill that was recently passed this past week by the house the trespass bill HR 347 um, well I did read a news line from RT America and also Alex Jones Infowars.com posted this Newsline, I, I can't get the uh, the print. This newsline uh, from RT America, and and he also published it on his we website, Infowars.com. Goodbye. First Amendment trespass bill will make protest illegal in the land of the free, and I went on. I read it. I read the whole entire news line from RT America. They said they would give secret uh, detail protection to the GOP candidates that are running for the Republicans for the nomination, for the Republican nomination, or the GOP a nomination to represent the Republican Party in the 2012 12 elections. They would give Secret Service protection to Newt Gingrich, to Mitt Romney, and Rick San Senate, the former Senator Rick Santorum. Secret Service protection. And uh, well, and 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 I could see Ron Paul. He's one of the four, one of the one out of the four candidates. I could see him them offering the Secret Service protection, he will put it down and say, hey, uh, this is against the the Constitution and the First Amendment, your First Amendment right, freedom of speech, to, to speak your opinion and to speak your mind. He would turn that uh, offer down and he would say, sorry, but I have my own so sec private security. <laughs> Stuff like that. Um, but uh, I feel this bill, it's going to put the final nail in the coffin for the First Amendment, freedom of speech. It's not right. And I would say about uh, somewhere between 3 to 4 or 5 percent of Americans are awake. They're aware this is going on in their own country. And, and the 95 percent of Americans in this country, they're asleep. They're not aware 
of things like this being passed in the bills like this being passed on the Senate floor or up on Capitol Hill. But, uh, what you know, the House passes this bill. And, uh, President Barack Obama will probably say he won't pass the bill. And that's the same thing that he said about the NDAAA. I won't pass it. But on New Year's Eve of, uh, last, this past New Year's Eve of 2011, he passed, he went and he didn't veto the, uh, the NDAA bill. He, uh, he signed it. And it, and it recently went in effect, let's see here. I know it went in, in effect March of, uh, March 1st of 2012, which was a Thursday. Um, uh, but when it's going to go on his desk, He's going to probably say he won't sign it. And then he probably will sign it. He will contradict himself. So, uh, you know, this is why I won't vote for President Barack Obama. And, well, and that's another reason why I changed my political party from Democrat to Republican. I won't vote for Barack Obama in the uh, 2012 presidential elections because he he makes promises then he doesn't then he goes back on the promises and he doesn't he doesn't go forth he doesn't back his word and promises to the people I, uh, this this is killing our country folks President Barack Obama will probably sign. He probably won't veto this bill. He'll probably sign it. And it will condemn the First Amendment. This is our heritage. This is our way of life. And and Americans are just going to stand by and take this. 95% of this country would take this, which are asleep. They'll rather worry about their big Ben Ro Roethlisberger and the sexual charges the sexual harassment charges going into the bathroom. He won't play football for the Steelers anymore. People, 95% of the people will care about that. They will care about dancing with the stars. They don't care about voicing their opinion. The people in this country have forgotten their role. They don't know their role anymore. The 95% of Americans don't know their role. And, well... I know my role, and I will, uh, and I am speaking up by posting this, by posting videos like this and others that I've posted up on my YouTube page. I'm voicing my opinion. Ah, uh, this makes me sick. Uh, like I said, it's it's my opinion. I feel this bill will put the First Amendment, the freedom of speech, to its death. And put by putting it in it in its coffin in the ground. The First Amendment. Rest in peace, 1791-2012. Barack Obama, I'm speaking to you. Please veto this bill. You are a lawyer. You are a lawyer. Well, and also a road scholar where ninety-five percent of the Americans probably don't know and if they do know they think it's a good thing because you're smart and very well educated no when you're a Rhodes Scholar it's like taking an oath a blood oath and and you're gonna join it and accept it and join it and it and you can't get out of it it's like the mob once you're in it you're in it for life uh, hmm well, you could also Google uh, the trespass bill, H.R. 347. And I will also have information down below, down below of this video in the definition box. Other, well, 
the RT America Newsline regarding this uh, regarding this bill, the signing of this bill, and the passing of this bill through the House. <sighs> well, this is Patriot of the Republic saying so long and goodbye and thank you. Have a good day. Hasta la vista, everybody. Goodbye. Take care.